The Dodgers and Red Sox made history early this morning, playing the longest game in World Series history. It took 18 innings and 7 hours and 20 minutes, and neither team disappointed. We pick up the action in the eighth with Dodgers up 1-0. Kenley Jansen on the mound. Jackie Bradley Jr. sends one deep to right field to tie the game at 1. Now under the 13th, Eduardo Nunez with a soft grounder to the pitcher. A bad toss to first. Brock Holt scores. Red Sox go up 2-1. to one. In the bottom of the 13th now, Yasiel Puig at the plate. He sends one to second, and another error scores Max Muncy. The game is tied 2-2. Remember that name, Max Muncy, because he comes back more than seven hours after the first pitch. Bottom of the 18th inning and sends a fly ball to left center, and over the wall it goes for a walk-off home run. Dodgers take an epic Game 3 win and some much-needed momentum into Game 4. Getting a chance to hit a walk-off home run, you know, obviously there's not many words I can use to describe that. The feeling was just pure joy and incredible, um, incredible excitement and, you know, that's about all I can think of because it's just, uh, it's hard to describe how good of a feeling that is. It's a, it's a great one to win. Uh, it was a must win for us. Um, our guys just persevered. It wasn't pretty, 